Hi, I'm Steph and this is my mom. And these are my greyhounds, Macintosh. So today we are going on the dog's first road trip. <laughs> we are currently in a van that is new to us. Um, I mentioned in a past video that my uh, aunt recently passed away. So we have her van because we've been moving, hauling stuff back and forth. Uh, so we had to kind of test the dogs to see how they would do in this van. So this is our first road trip with them and in this car. So we're kind of testing the waters to see how it goes. They got they got in the car well. We've been practicing for a couple weeks getting them in the car and comfortable. So that's gone well so far. And so you can see the dogs. Um, we put two beds in here and we separated it with a piece of foam. Um, and that's because Mac has sleep startle and sometimes she can um, wake up and be startled and can scare Tosh. And so we put that there. We may move it during the road trip depending on how it goes. Um, and we have some water there for them and I have all their supplies. We're actually headed to Orlando for some family things and the dogs are going to be staying with Daniel's family and Daniel um, and his family are the owners of Max, which I featured in a previous video. Max is um, one of my favorite greyhounds. I love all greyhounds, but he is a great greyhound and uh, he stayed with us a little while back, uh, over Thanksgiving actually. And uh, so they're going to be taking care of Macintosh and we thought we would kind of share the journey of how this goes. So, so far, so good. So the dogs are all packed and everything fit into these two buckets. So these are actual food bowls that are great for traveling with because uh, the dogs can eat out of this like raised bowl. So these I'm taking to Daniel's house for the dogs to eat from, but inside, are all their goodies. So I'll go over what I'm bringing for them. So first a brush, cause they need to be brushed. And then I have, these are some travel wipes for the dogs if I need to uh, wipe anything on the trip. And then Tasha, if you all remember, she is actually still wearing this hound tee um, because she has a cut and stitches on the side of her. Um, so I'm bringing an extra shirt, uh, a jacket here and an extra shirt in case they need to cover uh, you know, do any extra covering. And then I also have their muzzles in case there's any kind of issue where they might need to muzzle the dogs. And oh, that Tosh is really into that. Uh, don't think they will, but I'm bringing those just in case. And then this is just some cleanup cloths. If there's any accidents in the car, I can use that. And then this is for Daniel and his family in case there's any uh, bathroom issues that arise with Tosh at their house. This is to clean the carpet. So I'm gonna bring that just in case they need that. And that is everything in this one. And then over here, this is actually a splash bowl for the car to put their water in. Um, so I just have this on top and this helps um, from water from splashing when they drink from it. And then again, this will be where they eat when they're at Daniel's house. And in here, this is actually a diaper um, holder, like a portable diaper holder, but I put um, like the dog's poop bags in here if I need to, or like trash, any kind of like soiled trash I'll put in there. And then I'm bringing paper towels, cause you never know if you need that for, for the travel. I am bringing uh, just a little bit of kibble, but I have sent a full bag of their food to Daniel's house, so he has that already. These are some treats for them that they really like. These are some extra treats that they really like. I'm bringing some Ziploc bags in case there's any messes I need to put in there. I'm bringing um, rubber gloves in case I need to clean up any messes. These are extra poop bags because you always need those. These are the they get a half of the a half of this in the morning every morning. This is called a nibs bone or nubs bone. And then I'm bringing some puppy pads in case there's any puppy messes that I need to clean up. And that is everything that I'm bringing. And they have two beds that will be in the car. And there's also gonna be um, a crate at Daniel's house that the dogs will, that Tosh will sleep in. So got everything ready to go. So Mac has definitely been up more than Tosh. Tosh is pretty much down and, and good. But we're just kind of chilling out. We took the dogs for a walk today and given them um, some, they've eaten well, so we're hoping that they'll just kind of relax. And again, if we need to move the middle piece, we will, but we're gonna keep trying to keep it there for right now. There we 
go. Mac is settling. Also, I came up with this little hack here. I got a um, mirror from just like a normal mirror, I guess you'd use for hair or whatever, but I'm using this to look in the back at the dog so I don't have to keep turning my head. So that's been working pretty well. All right, so we are making our hopefully first and only stop on this trip. So we're gonna get the dogs out right now. Okay, be careful, be careful. Hold on, hold on. Oh, shoot, 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 shoot. No, 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 no. Gosh. Oh my gosh, okay. Exploring everything. Hey, buddy. Gotta so smell you everything. Here? Your friend's here? It's, it's so funny. Like any other dog, it takes months for him to warm up to mm. them. It's instant with Grays. Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi. How are you? <laughs> hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Oh. oh, is that it? He's got a mark. She marked over his. We gotta do the marking. Hey, buddy. Hey boy. So Tosh has already made herself at home on the couch. Of course. Didn't take any time at all. Did not take time at all. Probably snuggled in. Look at this sweet oh, puppy. Oh my goodness. Oh goodness. Yeah, she's gonna love this. Oh yeah, this is better than my couch. Yeah. Look at this. Better this is huge. This is the best dog couch ever.
It's actually been about a week since we got back from the trip, and I will say I actually filmed uh, the trip back, and I filmed, and Daniel filmed uh, the tr the dog's trip there, and took pictures and everything, so I'll be sharing that in another video. But I will say, spoiler alert, they had an amazing time with Daniel. Um, I was really anxious about this. Uh, this, Like I said, this was our first road trip with the dogs. We actually took Mac on a road trip in February of 2020, and if you know that date, uh, the world changed after that. So we... Um, um, we were not excited to take Mac for any other trips and that trip went okay her first road trip We had some issues with it. So we were not excited about another road trip But we kind of had to this this time around for some kind of family things that we needed to handle so uh, I was so excited the dogs did really well and we will probably be making more road trips down there because they took such good care of Macintosh uh, but if you notice Mac de definitely was anxious in the car and she would get up way more than Tosh Tosh didn't get up at all. She was just like, I'm cool. Um, so I'm gonna talk to my vet about possibly getting some anxiety meds for for Mac in the car, kind of look into that. Uh, but if you have any advice of traveling with a dog like Mac, let me know because uh, we're probably gonna be doing it a little bit more often. And if you are wondering, Tosh did get her stitches removed a couple days after we got back from the trip. My friend Stephanie, who is a certified vet tech, came over and she removed the stitches for me, which was so nice. I didn't have to take uh, Tosh anywhere. And it was painless and easy, and um, so the, the site's looking really good. Both of the cuts that Tosh got are looking great. Um, so big thank you to the emergency vet and for Stephanie for taking out the stitches. So I will leave you this, with this one clip um, that Daniel took right, uh, right at the beginning of when the dogs were staying with him. And I will remind you that greyhounds roo when they want to, whenever they want to, happy, sad, anything, they'll just rue, and that's what they're doing in this clip. All right, have a great day. <laughs>